in this episode of Grow My Efficient Business, I'm going to show you how you can build relationships that will increase the amount of customers you get and the quality of customer, decrease your competition, and something that will increase the value of your business and how much you can charge. So stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome to Grow My Efficient Business. I'm Chad Muncy and I want to thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. Please subscribe, like the videos. That helps me as I make more content that's valuable to you and your business. So today, I'm going to dive right in. This may be a shorter video, but it's very, very valuable and very, very important to your business and to the longevity of your business, to how strong your business is, to how many customers come in. I'm literally going to share with you something today, and I'm also going to give you something for free. But this thing that I'm going to share has changed my business. I say it's a secret because it took me so long trying different things, trying to figure out, should I market? Should I do marketing on Facebook? Should I do ads? What can I do? And this is something that I did that was just work. It didn't require any uh, money. It didn't require any investment. The investment was just time. And as I did this thing that I'm going to show you today, it helped my business reach over a hundred thousand dollars, and it just it just crushed the competition. It di it didn't really crush the competition. You're going to see what I mean in just a little bit. It helped me have less competition, and I actually had people that used to be my competition that were for me. And that is what this tool, this thing that I'm going to share with you can do for you. It can help you have better, more valuable leads. So the couples that come to you are very interested in your services and they're almost guaranteed to go with you and choose you. Uh, it will help your business be more valuable just in case in the future. I know some of you are in the very beginning of your business, but just in case you wanted to sell it or sell your website or sell something in the future, it will make your business very valuable to people who want to get into the same thing and may be interested in buying it. It will increase the value of not just your business, but the leads and the quality of your customers and your clients. And it will also decrease the amount of competition that you have in your area. And that is, it's such a cool thing because it's just a kind of a system that I came up with to find and create and cultivate strategic growth partnerships. Now, what the heck are you talking about, Chad? I know you're probably asking yourself that. What is a strategic growth partnership? Well, a strategic growth partnership, it'll twist your tongue and if you, you're not careful, is a business partnership that involves the sharing of resources, customers, marketing, and other tools between two or more businesses to help everyone involved succeed to help everyone involved grow and become stronger. So now you know what the definition is. <clears throat> the question is, how do I get these? I know I can probably uh, try to find people who like my business or I can meet vendors when I'm at a wedding or I can talk to people. But wait, before you think about starting to find people to set up strategic growth partnerships with to help your business, I want you to be aware of a few things because this is exactly what I did. This is the point at where I, I had a light bulb moment and I said, wait a minute, the people that are, that are wanting my services, the couples that are out there that need me already have relationships with established businesses around me. They have, there's a photographer up the road who's been doing weddings for 20 years. And if I could somehow uh, connect with him and connect with all of the customers he already has coming through. And then the videographer, the videographer, the videographer, the videographer down the road and the caterer down the road. And this other person, if I can connect with them, they already have a flow of customers coming to them. 
I just need to be put in front of that flow. I need to connect and get in front of the flow of leads. I need to connect with them, get in front of that flow of leads. And with all of them, with all of those strategic growth partnerships set up, I'll have a lot of customers coming my way. And all I did was set up uh, a relationship and establish a relationship with these people. <clears throat> but the question is, how do I establish a relationship with someone who is my competition? After all, relationships are everything. Relationships in this business are everything. Relationships with my customers, with my competition, with potential customers, uh, with vendors, with venues. Those relationships really do equal money and more relationships with customers. And that's how I'm going to build my business. So how in the world do I do this? First of all, I want you to understand a, th a few things. To set up these partnerships, they're not, they're not contractual agreements. They could be if you wanted to, but they're, they're not contractual agreements. They're just relationships. And to set these up before you do this, I don't want you to waste your time. You need to understand what areas of your business you are the weakest in. What are the problem areas in your business? Where are the areas in your business that you know that you struggle? Is it marketing? Is it the financial side and, and bookkeeping? Um, is, it, is it getting clients and getting leads? What area do you struggle with? If you struggle with all of these, that's okay. But you have to understand some things about your business before you start reaching out to other people. And once you understand those things, then you can target certain people to reach out to. You can you can look at someone and say, man, their website is just killer. Their process, the way they've got it set up, I love the way they price things. I like the way on social media they connect with their customers. You can start to gauge who is strong in a certain area. Maybe you see a Facebook ad and it's for um, a wedding photographer and like, man, he really knows how to do ads. I would love to be able to learn that. Find the people that are strong where you're weak. Now, not every one of these strategic growth partnerships are going to be perfect, but if you can find people who do things well that you also want to do well, and you can connect with those people, and then you can build a relationship, and then you can cultivate it, and then you can set up some kind of agreement where you both are getting customers. You're both on a, a list that you hand out, you hand out to your customers and they hand out to their customers. Then you're in this stream of leads and you're learning from that relationship. You're learning the things that you can incorporate in your business that they're doing and they can learn the things that you're really strong at that you're incorporating into your business. You see, you want to have a win-win. You, you want to have a win-win win actually, three wins. You want to have a win for you, a win for your client and their client, and then a win for them, your strategic growth partner. So how do you do that? I am glad you asked. This video is, is specifically for me to take a tool that I've created and hand it to you. And you can go and find a lot of resources on my website, growmyefficientbusiness.com. But I have recently put a tool on there I'm really excited about that I want you to have. And it's it's my gift uh, to you. I want you to do the work and incorporate it in your business. And it is simply called the Guide to Building Wedding Business Relationships. It doesn't matter if you're an officiant if you're a photographer, if you're a videographer, this is specifically, I designed it because I'm an officiant with officiants in mind, but it'll work for anyone. So if you're a wedding officiant, you got to download the guide. Go download the guide and you just go to my website, growmyefficientbusiness.com and then you answer a couple questions. Now, since it's a gift, I'm not asking for any money, but what I'm asking for is... Uh, a couple questions answered, and it's going to help me evaluate in the future how to help my students and how to help uh, people that are taking my course and all of those things. And it's just a few questions that I want you to answer. It's no personal information. All I need is uh, you to answer these two questions and then tell me what email I send the guide to and I'll send it to you. But but I want you to take advantage of this because a strategic growth partnership can change your business.
five strategic growth partnerships can literally be all the leads you need. And if you go beyond that and you do what I'm what I'm asking you to do for your own sake in this guide, then your business can literally change. It can decrease your competition and you can be set up and have a great foundation no matter if you're just beginning or if you've been doing this for years. Maybe you've already got partnerships like this, but it's always good to go, take a step back and reevaluate and maybe some of the partnerships you have aren't working out. Maybe you've never done it, or maybe you just want some more. And this guide will teach you some things that hopefully you didn't know and that you can incorporate into your business. I really hope this is helpful to you. Thank you so much for watching. I promise this video is one of many. I've been working on a lot of material, and I'm going to start putting some more out on the, on the YouTube channel here. Uh, on the podcast. If you're listening to the podcast right now, uh, I'm going to be putting some more podcasts out and then I'm loading the website down with resources. And I've got a lot of cool things coming soon. The main thing is go to the website, um, subscribe so that you can keep up with the things I'm doing and the free tools like this that I create. And then there's also another guide on the website, but just go check it out. I think you'll be uh, you'll be very happy, especially if you incorporate it in your business. You'll be happy with the results you get. And I want to hear about your results. If you've if you've heard something from the channel, from the podcast that's helped you, please go on the website, growmyefficientbusiness.com, and there's a place where you can send me your story. I'd love to hear your story and what's happening in your business. Thank you so much for joining me on today's video. Please subscribe. Uh, leave a comment. And I can't wait to talk to you again real soon. Have a great day.